So in the previous Arc Genesis episode, we tamed our beautiful Allosaurus, Al Capone here. And he's a level 227 tamed male. We haven't pumped any levels into him yet. Although I want to, but I don't like pumping levels into things that I know I'm going to use as breeders. So we need to get Al Capone a girlfriend today. You want a girlfriend, Al Capone? You want to make some sweet baby Allosaurus babies? What even words am I talking about? Uh, I kind of want to tame some Ferox today. I did get more elements, so we can uh, not tame more Ferox. We can breed more Ferox today. So we're gonna we're gonna do a little bit of a breeding episode, taming episode. I would also like to build this up. So I want to make that area the breeding area, and then I want to make this area our actual base. So I think I'm going to start building the water base today as well. So what we need to do is get our spider Dracula here. We need to head to the uh, lava biome of doom. And hope that we find another doom. Oh my goodness. High level Allosaurus. I would like to have it tamed out at above 200. So like 220s would be really nice. If I could find a max level female, then obviously... That would be absolutely amazing, but if you do find yourselves enjoying the Ark Survival Evolved episode, make sure to slap that like button. I know we had a couple days off where we weren't making Ark episodes, and I do want to apologize for that. I was working on our Red M servers, and I was spending a lot of time uh, talking to developers and getting people hired for it and just doing a whole bunch of stuff, and it kind of set me back a little bit on getting some server stuff built. But we're going to be pumping out the Ark episodes again, and I hope you all enjoy them. Oh my god! Oh, it's two aloes! Oh god, we spawned... So, Volcano North is an aloe spawn, which is why I spawned here. And there were two Allosaurus here already. I can't tell what level they are. We need to actually maybe escape here. And just kind of, kind of get my bearings back. And see if we can open up a spyglass and see. We got level 20 and a level 15. Okay, so that's not so bad. We can just murder those bad boys. And then we gotta hunt down more. They just they just scared me. Like, they were attacking me before I even loaded into the game. Like, that was ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. We need to get some prime meat as well. Oh, it looks like I'm just, like, exploding blood under the aloe. <laughs> it's a little ridiculous. Uh, let's see here. So I got a level. I know there's, there's two aloe spawns here. I guess we gotta find some others. I would like to find like a level 200 it, or more. Ooh, we got ourselves another Allosaurus right there. I really have been looking forward to getting some mutations on these. So that's a level 45. Um, Cause I just think it's gonna, honestly like the lava biome X dinos in general just look really, really cool. And I think they're gonna look even better once you can get some like color mutations on them and stuff. Uh, but also, if there's any other creatures in Arc Genesis that you want to see mutated, definitely make sure to let me know in the comments below, and we'll see what we can do. Alright, we got some Magmasaurs over here, which are honestly really good for getting all sorts of nice things. Oh, we got a T-Rex over there. Honestly, if we find a nice T-Rex, we're gonna, we're gonna tame it. Also, I need to go get more Narco. Well, no, we got a whole bunch of Narcotics on us. Uh oh, uh oh, oh god, we're on fire, we're on fire. It's bad, it's bad. Nope, it's not that bad. There we go. No, 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 no. I didn't know they could still light you on fire after you have uh, killed them already. So that's, that's that's good to know. We got 78 prime meat, which is going to be good. How many narco narcotics do we have on us? 435. That should be plenty to be able to tame a couple different things. We should be able to tame an X Rex and an X uh, Allosaurus with that. What level you is, hombre? 50? You're not a real T-Rex. This is blasphemy. Oh, man. We found a level 224 female Anki, which is pretty darn good. We've already tamed, um, I think, I don't know if we ever tamed a female Anki. I think we tamed a male one. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to teleport back and I'm going to see, I'm going to make sure that we don't have a female Anki this high level already. If we don't, we're going to tame that one. We might as well kind of just tame it already because it might have really good stats on it. We got to get this little glitch over here. Hopefully nothing will come out and eat our faces in. Yeah, give me them hexagons. I need more element.
Well, I'm definitely glad I checked, because we have a tamed level 323 uh, ex-Anki named Khaleesi. So we need a male one. I just, now that we're actually out where you can see the Anki a little bit better, the ex-Anki is freaking beautiful. Oh my god, I just don't even want to get mutations on it, it looks so good already. Anyways, we gotta get back to the fire biome. While it's not as high level as a uh, as the female one, but it is a level 216, and then we found another level 240 female over here. The females are really, really high level all over the place. We just need to find an, uh, an aloe. I haven't found a high level aloe yet, but you know what? We'll take advantage of this Anki now. We'll tame it. And then maybe we'll still find a, an Allosaurus. Because that way, then we can breed Ferox, Ankies, and Allosaurus all at the same time. Man, not having good luck with the whole... Ooh, Magnosaur. Allosaurus hunt today. But we did get that Anki, so that, that's cool. Ooh, there's a mission over here. Oh, no, not an Arthropleurite. Nope, 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 nope. I don't feel like getting my armor squirted and have it broken again. <laughs> the Magmasaur exploded after I jumped after it. <laughs> uh, we need to get a Magmasaur egg. I mean, we could totally go steal one now, but we'll have to do that for a specific episode because I think we can even breed them if I'm not mistaken, which is nice because finally, like, something that hatches from an egg can be bred, which is, like, the first time that's ever happened naturally. Um, but yeah, still got to hunt down that wonderful... Ooh, look at all the scorpions here. Allosaurus. You know what? The north spawns should actually be respawns. We just got to go back there, and we might be able to find one. Well, this is something I've never seen before. A female and a male 130. Just next to each other, just chilling like villains, like the best couple in Ark Survival Evolved. Murdering everything over here. I want to see them take on a Magmasaur. Oh, I think I see an, an aloe. Okay, nice. We got one spawned. Please be a female. Oh, oh, oh god. Oh god. <laughs> Let's try that again, shall we? What you is... Oh! Was that a 240? <gasps> it's a level 240! Okay, that... Oh, yes! We got our boy! A beautiful female allosaurus. Now, the real question is... How are we going to tame it? Last time we tamed one. So the X Allosaurus, they take so much longer. How much Torpor does this thing have? Three... Wait. Does that say 3,744? Whoa. Oh my god. But 21,000 health? Wait, no. That's my... That's my spider. <laughs> I was like, wait a second. How does that thing have such low Torpor? The last one we had around like 10,000. Can we scan this one, please, instead of my spider? No? Okay. All right. We'll just, uh, we're just going to start shooting it in the butt and hope for the best. Hopefully, it'll just stay distracted. There we go. Oh, my God. 15,340. And we're going up. Well, I didn't even hit it that time. What are we going up when I hit it in the face? Excuse me, sir. Or ma'am. Oh my god. Okay, the face hits are not doing so bad. So all we need to do is just kind of... I want to try and get it trapped in the trees again. Oh god, we're stuck. Oh god. Run, spider, run! There's a set of trees over here in the north area that I got it stuck in last time. Thanks, spider, for pooping. You know, we really needed to have that happen. I think it was these trees over here. If we can run it into these trees, get it all confused... Maybe we can get it stuck there and tame it in there again. It was these trees over here. So maybe we'll just like weave in, weave out, and maybe it'll get stuck again. I'm going to try and do this. We could just build a trap, but um, I'm going to try and do this the lazy man's way. Oh my god, we got it stuck. <laughs> it worked. All right. Um, so we're going to shoot you in the face. Oh, no, you're not stuck anymore. I will get you stuck, though. You were stuck. Oh, my goodness. We're going to take... I got to craft some more arrows. So we may or may not have had a couple of scares. We <laughs> The server crashed while I was taming up the Allosaurus, but we did get it back. 
I it, it must have like just saved when I put it in the cryopod or something like that. Uh, we've got the X male Anki here, which we need to name for. It currently has cryo sickness. Didn't even know that was a thing. Cause it's been so long since I've played Ark. Uh, but we then went, now we got Alice Capone, level 360. Just absolutely redonkulous. So this is awesome. And I love that they allowed us to actually be able to just finally enable mating and not have to deal with the insanity. Although I do kind of miss building, like, the breeding pits that would make it, like, super easy to breed while they were on wandering and stuff like that. But I guess we don't really need breeding pits anymore. Unless you want to do it for, like, maybe, like, the live babies. The, the gestation babies. You could probably do some stuff with that. But I really want to get some mutations. This guy's got cryo sickness. I got a... Let's see here. These... I think the, the Ferox that we were breeding are still in here. Yes, yeah, so we got uh, Gizmo and Foxy. 217 and 210? I don't know. Maybe we'll breed the... Maybe we'll just do the Anki and um, the, Al the Allosauruses today. We just need this Anki to wake up. I need to give you some stim berries or something. Do I have any stim berries? Where art thou stim berries? You got some, don't you, Dracula? You got some stim berries. Where, where, where are they at? Nowhere. <gasps> Twenty. <laughs> I got twenty-one stim berries. Do we have any stimulant anywhere? I could probably make some. Here, eat those. Oh wait. Is it not working? Uh, maybe, maybe a tiny bit. I don't know. I've never had to deal with cryo sickness before. We're so close to our first baby Allosaurus. Come on, give me that egg. The The trick to getting the mutations is you gotta catch the egg right in your stupid little hands. I did- oh, I did catch it. That's funny. <laughs> um, oh, it's too cold. Okay. We need some- oh, we don't have any fireplaces down here. I'm the worst. You know, I have- Wait, what? What Ferox was killed? <gasps> oh no! You guys not have food on you? I could have swore I gave you guys berries. Oh my god. Oh god, we need berries, stat! As I was saying before, I was so rudely interrupted. I have the technology to not be using fireplaces. Um, but apparently, I'm stubborn. Oh god. Little baby level 297, hello! What's your statisticals like? 5,500 health. Uh, 532% melee damage. You're gonna need some food there, home skill. Here, have some prime meat. We got some extra. They're so cute. I love the baby Allosauruses. They're just so freaking adorable. I mean, look at that face. It's a face a mom and literally everybody could love. Oh, also, the female Allosaurus we got is awfully pretty. Hold on, we need to disable wandering on you there, home skillet. Uh, disable wandering. No more follow. Like, she's got, like, this little purple bit on her leg, which is really nice. It's just pretty- it's cool. I really like that purple color, so we don't need to get a mutation on that one. We do need a lot more eggs. So we're retiring Al Capone there as our male breeder because this Allosaurus um, got the high health from both and the highest melee damage from both, which is what we want to breed. Uh, so now that we've got stats for, like, the highest stats for both of them, we'll be able to get higher level babies, and it'll be easier to get mutations on the melee damage and health, since that's really what we want to focus on. So we gotta name this one... Behavior... We need to change your name there, home skillet. Uh, options. Not, not neuter, that could have been bad. Allo Capone 2.0, perfect! So for those of you that don't know, I have tons and tons of breeding tutorials on the channel from back in the day from when I was doing lots and lots of breeding, especially for stats. Uh, but the key to really breeding and making things significantly easier on yourself is getting two dinos the exact same level with the exact same stats, and then you can breed for stats just significantly easier. Or at least significantly easier to tell uh, what's being mutated and stuff like that. But I really just want color mutations at the moment. Not too crazy. Obviously, we want stat mutations as well, but I just want to get some awesome-looking Allosaurus. We got another egg, and it's going to be a mutation. I could feel it in my bones. Well, well you're level 320, so that, 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 that's a good sign. You're a female, which is even better, which means we can get more eggs. We got no, no mutations. My bones were wrong. 
Oh my god, I stepped away from the computer for a minute, and we have... We must have had twins, triplets, I don't even know. This one's level 331, 336. Okay, we definitely had... Oh, okay, bye. <laughs> we definitely had um, at least one set of twins. Yeah, one set of twins. Did any... <laughs> God, no. It's a disaster. So they don't have a mutation. 297, probably not going to have a mutation. Nope. All right. And then 320. What you got on you? No mutations. All that excitement for nothing. This egg is going to be the mutation. Come on. Level 360. That's a perfect one. 360. What are you? Oh, you're a female, too. Okay. All right. Uh, behavior. Disable wandering. We got another baby all the way over here. We need a 360 male. We got another 320 here. No mutation on there. That's a male, which is going to be better for breeding. All right. So we're going to have to... This is going to be Al Capone... Allo Capone 3.0. We got to get the male up to 360 so we can get better mutations or easier... Basically, easier to be able to tell when we get a mutation, because the levels will be exactly the same. When we get a mutation, you get plus two levels, and you want care home skillet? I don't feel like walking you. Ooh, we finally got a mutation. Where'd it go? Okay, so this is a 360. We want that, especially if it's a male, it's perfect. And this one's level 322. So that's what I was talking about. You get two levels when you get a mutation. So something on this wonderful creature is mutated. Uh, there it is. It's not health, and it's not melee damage, so one of the other stats that I don't particularly care about mutated. The real question is, do we get a color mutation on it? 326? Wait, how did that happen? Oh, I know how that happened. Okay, no mutation on that one. But this one does. I just... I don't think it came out as a color? It might be the feet there? Hold on, do we have... All of you need to stop following me. <laughs> Is the feet mutated? No, the feet are not mutated. So I think we just got a stat with a hidden color mutation. Because uh, for those of you that don't know, all mutations come with a color mutation and a stat mutation, but sometimes the color mutation can be passive as well as the stat mutation. So sometimes it just doesn't show up, but it can show up later on down the line. I don't see anything unless... No, no it looks exactly the same. Hmm. There we go, a level 362. I don't see any color mutations on it. We didn't get a health or a melee damage mutation. We did get a new patrilineal one, so something. We'll have to take a closer look and see. I need to slow down the, the growth process. We can get full imprinting with the current stats, but I hate, kinda hate how quick they grow. I mean, it's nice to be able to get, like, more females to be able to breed, but at the same time, they just, they grow a little too quick. Wouldn't you say you want to cuddle? I don't see any color mutations on these guys. Not yet, at least. Unless that brown is one on the... Nope. Nope. Definitely not. Oh, we definitely got our first mutation on this one. Looks like we got black spines. Oh, <laughs> we got two mutations on this one. Yeah, we got two matrilineal mutations on one go. Nice. We got the blacks. Ooh. You know what? That looks really, really nice. I've never been... I've never actually... I've gotten black mutations before. But not on really anything that I wanted them on. But I really like it with the fire and everything. It just looks really nice. That's our first mutation, ladies and gentlemen. Technically, we got two on one, which is even crazier. I don't know what else could have mutated. I don't see... I think that's the only color that actually changed. But it looks really, really, really good. We gotta figure out a name for you, my precious. Are you a male or a female? What What you is? You a male? You know what? I'll cuddle you. I'll give you some cuddles. After 10 million years, this Anki is finally awake. I wanted to breed these in this particular episode as well. But, you know, lo and behold... They stayed asleep the entire time. Ooh, I like your blue spikes, boy. I like them a lot. Didn't really get to look at them the first time. But uh, we did finally get the one mutation, which looks nice. We got uh, like a purplish blue there. Then we got black on this one, which looks 
mighty fine. I wonder if we could make like a fully like jet black and red one. That'd probably end up looking really nice. You should probably eat some food and get some health back there, home skillet. <gasps> oh, we got a baby egg. We got an egg, baby. Excuse me, sir. Go ahead and do that and that. Maybe we'll get lucky again, question mark? That's not a fertilized egg. That one is. Nope, level 360. Are you a female so we can get more eggs, question mark? Nope, we keep getting... Oh, God, don't punch the baby. Jesus, Tag, what are you doing with your life? What a disaster. Well, anyways, ladies and gentlemen, we got a lot done. We got an Anki tamed. We got another Allosaurus. We got our first legitimate color mutation. We've got a mutation on there. But we didn't get a color mutation. So we're working towards getting our fully mutated uh, Allosaurus. We got another egg over here. Let's hatch that one before we, before we leave. Maybe this final egg at the end of the episode will be what we need. Light, light. Come on, cross your fingers. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Level 360. Are you at least a female? No. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right. Well, we didn't get any good luck there at the end, but I do hope you all enjoyed the episode. Make sure to slap that like button. Show it some love for the baby Allosauruses. And I'll see you all in the next one.